Yo guys and welcome back to this new video here on the channel and on today's video we're going to discuss the Bitcoin price action where we're right now retracing towards a very very bullish level and I will be talking about this of course on this video so if this sounds interesting for you don't forget to right away smash up that like button of course the more likes this video will be getting the more viral the cryptocurrency content is going and of course the more viral the cryptocurrency content is going the more people will be getting exposed to crypto so don't forget to smash it up here as well if you do like the content don't forget to hit that subscribe button and with that out of the way let me start off with discussing the bitcoin price section so what we can right now see is very important and very crucial for bitcoin so you can see last time around bitcoin was forming this local top around to 57.5k and this was a level that we were not able to break through here and since earlier today we started to pump and we started to rise we broke through this very crucial level of resistance and right now we are retesting this level and i will be for sure approach this like an extremely bullish re Test. So I am right now very comfortable that the market could be seeing a very solid projection, uh, uh, yeah, pro projection here once again towards the upside getting made here. I do think the chances are relatively high. We're going to see a bounce from this point. So it is looking particularly good right now after seeing this previous high getting broken and right now getting retested. Then as well, guys, yesterday yesterday we exactly predicted this move towards the upside we exactly predicted it once again just like we did several times on the channel so if you already like that don't forget to of course subscribe to the channel ring the bell notification so you're not going to miss out on these videos but how we recognize that real quickly guys to of course educate you guys and still help you guys out here so how we basically recognize this move towards the upside it was relatively easy because Bitcoin was of course in a downtrend and if you're in a downtrend what do you want to be doing you want to be looking for a trend reversal signal so market was moving down and the RSI was forming a bullish divergence, money flow index bullish divergence, our uh, MACD as well bullish divergence. So the three different momentum indicators that we were looking at were showing us the trend was about to reverse and it was of course exactly like we told you as well yesterday on the video. So while we are using this information to our advantage right now what is this telling us in this current run-up so in this current run that we're creating we're of course forming a higher high right now on the chart and while we were forming this higher high on the chart the one hourly candles clearly did form a lower high here on the rsi so bitcoin was still creating a bearish divergence here on the top side that was also the reason why it cooled off ever so slightly but right now since retesting uh, retesting this lower side over here we could be of course maybe uh leave this bearish divergence behind us once again and of course start to create newer high so yeah it was looking good this uh pullback was like to expect and right now we could be of course aiming for higher targets afterwards but what if we're looking towards this important pattern that we're right now looking at so this pattern is right now giving me a major warning out there on the market because what we're right now looking at it's an ascending broadering wedge for Bitcoin. And if you don't know already, ascending broadering wedges for Bitcoin or just for, or for every single currency or for every single uh, chart you're, you're charting, it's a bearish bias pattern. So you tend to say higher highs getting formed, higher lows getting uh, formed as well here and this of course has a very big tendency to break towards the downside so it is relative, relatively very likely to see a breakdown of this pattern and if we're going to be talking about a price target it's going to be from the beginning of the impulsive move so if i'm going to talk about a price target of this descending broadening wedge here sorry ascending broadening wedge here it's going to be on the 51.8k for bitcoin so how could we be avoiding this price target towards the downside? It's going to be very important. So first of all, we need to see, of course, a solid bounce from of this level we're right now looking at, of course, on Bitcoin, this horizontal level. And then third of all, it is going to be important that Bitcoin is going to be breaking this top side of resistance. So you can clearly see this has been a rejection zone for Bitcoin already for quite a few days here. So for, for the past approximately seven days here, Bitcoin has been getting rejected by this level. And it's important to break through it right now here because otherwise Bitcoin is losing too many steam because because if you're looking right now to the four hourly candles, you can see that this Bitcoin rally looks to be, of course, slowing down ever so slightly. So what do we know? If Bitcoin tends to go parabolic and it tends to slow down here, it could be losing massive momentum and, of course, potentially go down again. So it looks to be that we're losing ever so slightly the momentum on the four hourly time frame. And that could be, of course, very bad for this chart because the one hourly candle, of course, is right now showing us a bearish bias pattern. So that is, of course, important to break. Of course, guys, if you want to be staying up to date about all these updates, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. It's at Rover C. And if you're going to follow us on Twitter, you will be staying up to date about all the market developments out there. It's the second, yeah, second highest link here in the description. So don't forget to hit that follow button over there as well. 
And guys, if you want to be trading the market, since, of course, we call the market reversal exactly perfectly on the channel, you first want to be, of course, subscribed to the channel. But if you want to be trading the market as well, don't forget to sign up here with Bybit in the link of the description. The highest link in the description, you will be able to sign up with Bybit. And just like I showed you my strategy, how I called this market reversal, you could have been trading this because I did clearly told you guys I was opening a new long position and we could have made a 7% gain. And if you were using a 10x leverage, you already made an approximately 70% of your trade. So don't forget to sign up here with Bybit and of course if you're already going to sign up and of course set up your account and you're just going to follow the channel you are not going to miss out on the next trading opportunity because Bitcoin is full with opportunities and the next opportunity is laying around the corner right now so make sure that you're going to sign up make sure that you're setting up your account and of course keep your eyes on the channel because the next trade is coming up anytime soon here and I'm looking forward towards it so let me continue on the same time with my analysis. So Bitcoin in the meantime, for the candle is losing steam. And the reason why I'm saying so is because Bitcoin is setting lower highs on the RSI while it is still forming this higher high trajectory on the chart. So that's, of course, looking a little bit more bearish. And um, that is, of course, a thing to pay attention to. So you form a higher high on the chart, lower high on the RSI. Bearish divergence looks to be Bitcoin is losing momentum on its current uptrend as well. Yesterday, how we called this uh, trend reverse as well was due to the hidden bullish divergence that we got created here along the way up. So that was, of course, looking particularly good here as well. If we're looking to um, resistance levels, you can see this red box, major previous resistance. And right now, we're going to look at the time when we're right now trading on. We right away saw a rejection from that point. So it's going to be as well crucial level to break through. So it's not going to be the one hour resistance, but as well, the four hours is going to be having a hard time to be breaking through this level. We really need to have a significant pump but I do have a lot of faith in the level that we're already trading on. So we'll keep your eyes out wide open on this channel because as soon as we're seeing another market development, I will be dropping out another video. But guys, this was already it for the today for today's very quick market update. Of course, if I've seen an, a very interesting thing once again playing out on the market, I will be the first one here on YouTube that's going to be posting a video. So guys, thank you so much for watching once again. There's amazing new update video here on the channel. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out. Goodbye.